Fired heaters consume more fuel than any other asset on site. And if a fired heater is even one or two percent inefficient, it can consume over a million dollars in additional fuel over the course of a year. Fouling occurs when deposits accumulate on the tube or fin surfaces. The burner alone is designed to operate with one part per million airborne particulate. This means that a single burner can pass two and a half tons of debris through a heater in a year, some of which will deposit. Airborne debris is sucked in from the surrounding area. In a desert location, dust will make up a large proportion of the waste. If surrounded by agriculture, waste from harvesting will be drawn in. And in an industrial location, waste products from surrounding plants will also make up the debris being sucked into the asset. Just one of the side effects of fouling is an increase in emissions, something which, if excessive, can be liable to government fines. Higher fuel consumption results in a higher stack temperature and reduced heat transfer. Higher temperatures cause heat stress on tubes, creating uneven expansion and irregular heat distribution, which potentially leads to tube failure. All of these things negatively impact plant profits to the tune of millions of dollars.